Hello, good evening. Um, it is 12.53 a.m. Yeah, I'm once again in the hallway, this time because Brianna's probably asleep. And I'm not going to poke my head in there just to find out what yes she is. Um, today was pretty fantastic. Um, I'm probably going to gloss over most of class because I did a lot of things this afternoon because it's like my first proper Friday and people were very excited that it was Friday so like lots of stuff went down. Um, so you know I got up and I did school and nothing exciting happened. We had a fun discussion and then again about Vikings. I have a lot of homework to do tomorrow. I have a paper to write and stuff. Like what? Um, and chorus was fun. I have a concert in nine rehearsals from now, which is not long at all and sort of frightening, but we'll see what happens. Um, but then I came back to the dorm and um, I had lunch, whatever, and then I did a new wall of stuff. And tomorrow I will properly record my wall of stuff because where I had my Disney Princess poster up on the wall, it just refused to stay up. Like literally every day that poster fell down. So I said, screw it to that poster, it's in my closet. I printed out a ton of stuff, and I have a wall of stuff over my computer now, and um, it's quite fantastic. And in the center of this wall of stuff is my crayon drawing of Neverland, and I love it. And yes, I'll show that to you properly tomorrow. Um, and while I was doing that, Gabby was hanging out in my room, and we were singing songs and chatting and stuff. Um, and then I went out to eat in the cellar again for dinner with a group of people. Um, Emily and Laura and Gabby and I think his name is Sean and Jeremiah and people. And we had a cellar and that was fun. I had a fantastic grilled cheese, like like life changingly good grilled cheese sandwich. Life changing. Um and then the Yuma Dorm was showing how to train your dragon in the lobby and I watched that and I love that movie. I wasn't really associating with other people for that movie. I was just watching and enjoying that movie. Um, and then a large group of third floors of Yuma went and we played um, Epic Croquet. No, we, went, we played Extreme Croquet. And the way Extreme Croquet works is just croquet at night and you put glow sticks on the hoops, you put glow sticks on the balls, and you put glow sticks um, like on yourself and you just play croquet in the dark. <laughs> it was fantastically hilarious and bizarre and um, we just walked like just a green space and we set it up and put the hoops in like the worst places possible to try to get to and uh, me and Gabby were a team and like we, were, we would like do okay for like a while and then completely screw ourselves over and get stuck back in last place and then we would do okay again for a while and like we would catch up, it'd be really exciting, and then we would screw ourselves up and get back at last week. So, um, yeah, we did not come close to winning. Um, Ramon and Steven won. No, Ramon and Alberto won. And they should not have won because they kept screwing my team over by um, setting us back a hoop. If, cause if you hit somebody else's ball, you could send them back a hoop or whatever, and they have to start over. And they did that to me like three times. So justice should not have allowed them to win, but they did. And I was against it, but whatever. And then Alberto carried me all the way back to the door. <laughs> Good times. He's the one who knows Chris Goldman. I mean, he doesn't know him, but like he has associated with him. Anyway. Um, and at that point, it was like 9.30, 10 o'clock-ish, and we made a run to EG's. To get late night EGs, and we came back to the dorm and we went to Zombieland in the rec room. And um, now it is now. Oh, you know what? I skipped um, when I went to get lunch. I sat. I went to the rec room with my lunch with Gabby, and they were watching Moulin Rouge in the rec room. So I sat and watched Moulin Rouge with them. Um, <laughs> so I sat and I watched Moulin Rouge with them, and um, cried very badly at the end of that movie. And then I. To try to like walk back to my room with dignity and cries. <laughs> like, I was a mess. And I walked in the room and Brianna was like, oh my god, what's wrong? I was like, so tired. Um, but that was my very long, very epic day. And it was
for some reason, that was only five minutes, that explanation of my very long day. But I would like to talk about who I just originally had the thought, you know what we should buy to be ready for college? We should buy a croquet set. <laughs> Who's, like, plans to that factor into? But, I mean, it factored into somebody's. I don't know. It was a good time. Doctor Who comes on tomorrow. Well, today. Doctor Who comes on tonight. And uh, my dorm cable does have BBC America, and there's totally going to be a Doctor Who party in the rec room tonight. And it's going to be fantastic. Rory's going to punch Hitler in the face, and um, I'm just going to die of happiness because I am a Rory Williams stand for life. And I can't wait to cheer him on as he punches Hitler in the face. And to figure out who this Mel girl is, and so much more. Finally understand the freaking eye patch lady. So many mysteries to be resolved tonight at I think eight, possibly nine, possibly seven. I don't know. So yes, that was my day. Ten other things to say about my day, besides that my day was rather fantastic. Made only more fantastic by y'all's presence. I would like to play extreme croquet with you. One day we shall. So um, the thing I learned today, besides how to play extreme croquet, um, I have no idea what I learned today, guys. I don't think I learned anything today. <laughs> okay, here's what I learned today. Okay, when we were coming back from EG's to the dorm um, around 10 o'clock, there were a bunch of people, like just in a big group, just like wandering around. And I asked Ramon, like, what the heck were those people doing? And he said they were walking around looking for a party. Which is like the lamest thing I think I've ever heard of. Like seriously, you don't have anything to do for the night, so you're just gonna walk up the street until you find the place at a party and just go in there without any prior knowledge. That's so dumb. I can't even begin to explain to you. So, um, what's going on today? That some people. And I'm gonna expand upon this. This is going to become a lesson. Um, I learned today that in college there are certain groups of people that rather than making their own plans or inventing their own fun, go walk on the streets at night looking for a party to tag onto. And that is not cool. And you shouldn't do that. Because we made our own fun with a croquet set and some glow sticks. No party required. So um, don't be those people that walk up and down the street. Okay? Be those people who think ahead and bring croquet sets to college. Be that person. So uh, that's my lesson, and I'm going to say good night and go to sleep. And yes, I hope you watch Doctor Who tomorrow today. <laughs>